Fel rhan o brosiect gofal solfach, mae gwirfoddolwyr o'r pentref yn treulio amser gyda'r hennoed neu bobl sydd angen seibiant yn y gymuned. Um, I have 28 volunteers who do a variety of things like um, transport, respite care for people who look after their relatives, do shopping, dog walking, um, anything really that, that people need help with that isn't medical or personal. And uh, it's working really well because there are so many of volunteers. Nobody has to do terribly much. Well, uh, you know, Lena came down and offered to get Sandy to, uh, from Bridney to come in and walk the dog sometimes. And I find funny things for her to do, like sorting my bed out when I've lost uh, my hearing aid, <laughs> that sort of thing. And uh, it's, um, you know, it's very nice for me because she chats about her life and I enjoy learning about other people's lives. I don't really want to talk about mine, it's a bit boring, but uh, I like to hear what other people are doing. And uh, that, that's um, really how it goes very quickly when you mm. come for an hour, doesn't mm. it? Yeah, it was very interesting as well, because I'm studying to go on to be a nurse, and Betty was a nurse. <laughs> yeah. It was quite interesting to talk about that. Yeah, well, I don't know. It's a long time ago. <laughs> My dad of Gwasanaethau Cymdeithasol a Llethiant Cymru yn cynorthwyo cymunedau i ddod ynghyd i helpu ei gilydd. Bydd mwy o help ar gael i bobl pan fo angen, fel nad yw problemau yn gweithygu. So we did a, a survey, trialed it, um, did a whole series of questions, took it out to the community and got uh, an 85% return on it, vastly in, in support of the idea. Uh, and lots and lots of people saying, I would like to volunteer. One section of the, the um, survey uh, was specifically aimed at people already receiving care. The other, uh, those who were not yet receiving care but might. I think we, talk, we talk about my college yes, and my work in college. We talk about the weather. <laughs> and your boyfriend. And my boyfriend, yes. Um, Sometimes. I don't know, what, what else do we talk about? I don't know. Anything really. And we worked very early on with our local surgery, the GP practice just down the road here, very central in the village. Uh, and they were um, very encouraging, very supportive. And Lena is there once a week in the surgery on Friday mornings. And the, we have a close relation, a close working relationship. We are able to refer cases to them and they refer cases to us. So that works really well. And the other thing that I perhaps would want to stress is that we determined early on to be proactive and not to say to people, contact us when you need help, although clearly we would like them to do that, but to tell us almost in advance so that we can preempt problems and stop things getting to the point where it means hospital or nothing, uh, so that we can be preventive and supportive uh, and ha get people actively involved. I mean, people like Betty could go and talk to other people who are only, um, and many of the people that we are currently caring for are themselves taking part in village activities. I knew several of the things Lena has arranged, people have turned up, haven't they? That yeah, and we, we link in with things that are already going on, like the luncheon club on a Wednesday and coffee morning on a Thursday, and there's the memory cafe in St David's, and we just make sure that people can get there mm -hmm. and encourage them to go as well to, to get out and about a bit more. Yeah. I, I think people care about each other, mm -hmm. uh, like Molly mentioned earlier about referrals. We sometimes get People like Betty will say, you know, how's he in here because I've heard he's not very well yes. or maybe such and such would like a visitor. So we do get referrals from all over the place and it just seems initially I think people were more, maybe a little bit dubious about it and people don't always like to ask for help. But I think now that they've started doing it and they're seeing other people uh, joining, it's, it's become, it's okay. <laughs> no. Um, walk very well, but I walk quite well with that walker. So. so you walk with me sometimes when the weather's nice enough and we walk drinker together yeah. sometimes? Yeah. We are conducting our own research. We have our own research subgroup looking at evaluating what's happening, monitoring what's going on, because we're very aware that um, it is different 
and that other people might want to do the same. In fact, we've already had contact from several groups, several areas who do, and uh, Lena has prepared a presentation, and uh, we can present what we've done so far, what we've learned, things that we found easy, things that we found difficult, blocks to progress, and things that encourage progress. So we're hoping to be able to spread it more mm. widely. Well, there's no reason if it works here, it mm. could work anywhere else, really. I think Brown is fine. I, I was <laughs> delighted when she turned up and seemed so nice. I re really like it. It's very, very good fun coming to talk to Betty. <laughs> well, we've had some fun. Yeah.